Your smartphone has your whole life on it. It's your point of connection to the people and the world around you. It's also an incredibly powerful computer. The speed and power of our smartphones rarely hold us back, but the small screens and limited interface often do. That's why we created the Superbook, a simple plug and play device that turns your Android smartphone into a beautiful laptop computer. Just connect your phone to the Superbook using a USB cable. The Superbook provides the keyboard, multi-touch trackpad and display, and your smartphone brings the computing power along with your files and apps. And of course, the Superbook can use your smartphone's data, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth connectivity. The Superbook has over eight hours of battery life and it even charges your smartphone. It works with all modern Android devices and it's future-proof. When you get a new smartphone, it'll still work with your Superbook. It's like getting a brand new laptop every time you upgrade. Starting at just $99, the Superbook is a fraction of the cost of a traditional laptop and is even more convenient. Hi, I'm Andrew, co-founder of Andromium, makers of the Superbook. I was frustrated with having such a powerful smartphone, but with an interface designed purely for mobile use. Our goal with the Superbook is to eliminate the restrictions that hold smartphones back. The software side of the Superbook is Andromium, an app that makes Android function like a familiar desktop operating system. You get a mouse cursor, keyboard shortcuts, desktop class browsing, and easy file management. Everything is intuitive and optimized for productivity. There's no custom firmware to install and no technical knowledge needed. Simply download the app from the Play Store and connect to your Superbook. You can use one of our native apps or any of the millions of Android apps in the Play Store. We're also introducing an open SDK to enable developers to add Andromium optimization to their apps. We've already released a beta version of Andromium in the Play Store, where it's received hundreds of thousands of downloads and extremely positive reviews. We've been developing the Superbook and Andromium for over a year, and we're excited to finally release them. Our prototypes are complete, and we're ready to move into full production. We're looking for your support to help us make this new kind of computing a reality. The Superbook is just the beginning, and we're excited for you to be a part of it. Thanks for your support. Hello Kickstarter, we are Onion. As makers, we use development boards to build all sorts of cool stuff. But most development boards on the market fell short of our expectations. They're bulky, confusing to set up, and overcomplicated. We usually spend far more time reading the documentation than actually using them to build things. Today, we're changing that. Say hello to the Omega 2, the world's simplest development board. The Omega 2 is tiny. At less than a quarter of the size of your credit card, it can easily fit into any project. But don't be fooled by its size. The Omega 2 is powerful. It is a full Linux computer. That's right. This tiny purple thing runs the same operating system that powers some of the world's most mission-critical infrastructure. The Omega 2 works out of the box. It comes with built-in Wi-Fi and onboard storage, so it comes to life the moment you power it on. The Omega 2 is familiar. You control it with apps just like your regular computer. We even have an app store so you can discover apps created by the community. The Omega 2 is easy to program. In fact, you don't even have to write any code. It supports Node-RED, a graphical tool that you can use to create programs by simple drag and drop. But if you are into writing code, the Omega 2 supports many programming languages. Pick one you're already familiar with and start building. The Omega 2 is cloud connected, so you can remote control it securely from anywhere in the world. The Omega 2 is expandable. We have created many plug and play expansions, so adding new features to your project will look something like this. The Omega 2 is affordable, starting at only $5. Yep, five. It is cheaper than this Frappuccino. We want to lower the barrier to entry so everyone can join the maker movement. So you see Kickstarter, the problem is that the tools for building amazing things are just not accessible for everyone. And that is why we're working so hard to make the Omega 2 really easy to use. 
but we need your help to make it affordable as well. So please back our campaign and tell all your friends. We can't wait to see what amazing things you'll come up with. Thank you. We'd like to introduce our all-new DOS Keyboard 5Q. It's going to revolutionize the way you gather and track the information you care about by transforming your keyboard into a dashboard keyboard. And you will never want an input-only keyboard after this. Are you an over-tabber? Do your web browsers look like this? Which one of these is my inbox? How many notifications do you get in a day? How long before you just start ignoring them all? The things you want to know can easily get drowned out by all the other stuff out there. And it's made information gathering kind of a pain. But fear not over tabbers and alert snoozers, DOS Keyboard is developing a new kind of keyboard that's going to change all of that. DOS Keyboard 5Q is an RGB LED keyboard that's software driven and allows you to customize the color and pattern of every key based on the information that you actually want to follow. Instead of relying on snoozable momentary alerts from different devices, DOS Keyboard 5Q allows you to ambiently track subtle changes to data over time without actively seeking updates or constantly receiving new alerts, which frees you up to work on other super important things. You can think of DOS Keyboard 5Q as a device that takes information you want to keep tabs on and plugs it directly into your subconscious. Kind of like how you don't need to look out your window to know it's not raining. The streaming information exists in your peripheral vision, so you can track it without even thinking about it. DOS Keyboard 5Q's volume knob also functions as the Q button, which links you to QApp, the cloud software that powers the dashboard. QApp is being developed with a set of pre-installed profiles geared towards certain sets of notification needs. But what truly makes the software powerful is that it will be community-driven and have an open API. So your keyboard won't just be connected to the cloud, it will be linked to the cleverest, geekiest, most badass hive mind on the internet. With that kind of customizability, the applications of DOS Keyboard 5Q are virtually limitless. Pretty much anything online that you want to keep an eye on can be embedded into your workstation and color-coded to indicate the status. With the tap of the Q button, you can review and immediately address critical alerts, making procrastination, or maybe just a missed deal, a thing of the past. We are building DOS Keyboard 5Q with premium materials, an ultra-sleek design, the fastest electronics, and the most durable mechanical key switches in the market. Plus, it's just a more fun, nicer to look at, badass device. So that's DOS Keyboard 5Q a brand new genre of keyboard, a one-size-fits-all connected solution for increasing efficiency, lowering stress, and tracking what you care about in a non-invasive, ambient way. We've finished the design and are just about to start production, but we need your help to get DOS Keyboard 5Q on your desk. We hope you will join us as we shake up the world of computer peripherals with this groundbreaking dashboard keyboard. You guys are truly badass. Thank you from the whole DOS Keyboard team. Measuring tapes help us measure distances and the dimensions of different objects. But a measuring tape doesn't work in every situation. Why isn't there a single tool that lets us measure everything? Now, there is. Introducing Bagel, the smart tape measure. Bagel lets you measure just about anything, at home and at work. Bagel has three different modes, string mode, wheel mode, and remote mode. String mode is great for measuring straight lines, curves, and around corners. Wheel mode lets you measure irregular or odd-shaped objects. And it also makes taking measurements with one hand much easier. Remote mode lets you measure objects that are far away and out of your reach. After you're done measuring, you'll need a way to record your measurements. Using pen and paper can be a real hassle. With Bagel, you can quickly and easily save your measurements with voice descriptions. 
Just take your measurement, push the save button, and then tag a voice memo to it. To off the future radar. When you're done, Bagel will send your measurements to Bagel's mobile app via Bluetooth. This mobile application lets you review your saved measurements and share them with your friends. Bagel is precise. It uses our patented technology to make sure you always get an accurate measurement. Also, Bagel has an easy-to-read digital display that's viewable in most lighting conditions. In the past few years, all sorts of measuring devices have become smarter and made our lives easier. Smart scales, smart thermometers, and even smart watches. But when it comes to measuring size, we still use a tape measure which is more than a century old. Why don't we innovate the way we measure size? So we created Bagel, a smart tape measure. We put a lot of effort into creating Bagel. Our team worked night and day to make the best quality product with this friendly design. We have our final prototype that is ready for mass production. Now we need your help to deliver this amazing product to everyone. Please help us bring this bagel to life. Thank you. Size matters. Bagel. The first time I brought out the rover after finishing the design, I took it to my favorite skate spot. I just made this new board, I was ready to go. It was just me and it was, it was perfect. I felt like I was on top of the world, waiting to drop in. 121C boards is a lot more than just a skateboard company. It's a prototype to solve an industry-wide problem, in fact, a global problem of carbon fiber waste disposal. We'd really like to thank those people that supported us with the first Kickstarter last summer, which allowed us to go a lot further, a lot quicker than we thought. During the production of the aileron, we noticed that we were still generating a small amount of scrap, and so we decided to put that material to good use. That's when I knew we had it. This was, this was the board we were about to start making. We really began to see that we wanted to engineer a board that was totally different. It's a time-consuming process. We start with one iteration, go back, change it again. We wanted to make it sleek and stark, kind of had it looking like a missile. It's got those sharp, angular features that make you think of an aggressive aircraft. But there's a lot of purpose behind that engineering. We knew we had to put a hole in the board because we wanted people to be able to lock it up. We wanted to have a shape that relayed and conveyed its origin as an aerospace product. We ended up sweeping that hole back and giving it a slight curve on one side and a hard angle on the other, turning it into more of an aerodynamic shape. It all starts with processing. We get the shipments of scraps of material and we cut it to length and width, then kit it, load it into the press, and then take it out to the water jet cutter. Each board that we make gets water jet cut to an incredible tolerance within five thousandths of an inch. An 80,000 psi stream of water comes and blasts the material out of the way. What you're left with is a perfectly cut, symmetrical skateboard. From the water jet cutting to the pressing to the trucks, we have carefully engineered every aspect of the board to give you the highest performance. We really focused on stability. The rover is really the stablest small board on the market. The carbon fiber composite is huge. It allowed us to make the board smaller, thinner, and lighter. We have a new tighter wheelbase. It gives you that great handling. It feels very nimble and light. This board represents the passion and innovation of 121C. It's light, it's smooth, it's unlike any other board. It's far higher quality material than you can get in any consumer product. When we finally finish our board, it's like emerging from a cave. I felt like I was on top of the world, and then I dropped in on it. It's a whole new way of approaching skate. For those of us 
the love, the art of engineering. This is the board for us. After iteration and iteration, we're finally ready to bring what we brought to the Kickstarter last time, and we're really happy with how it turned out. I really want to thank everybody who supported us in that first Kickstarter effort. Uh, that was fantastic. You helped us build a production facility that lets us deliver boards on a daily basis to everybody that orders them, and is letting us bring out this exciting new product, the Rover, which is going to make carbon fiber affordable to all skaters.